Assamese people are one of the indigenous people in the northeastern part of India. Bihu is their main festival. You may see some of the uncommon dishes during this time. Have you ever seen eating insects during this time by these people? As a part of few of their traditional dishes, few communities during this Bahag Bihu, they make this dish during the first day of Bihu. Few kilometers away from the town, cycling to some of the village road and few kilometers of hiking, it brought me to a village in Sipsagar in Assam. Surrounded by lots of woods and tea garden, this remote village is extremely beautiful with its natural beauty. Occupied by lots of forests, you may see some unique dishes prepared during this time of April. Unlike many of Indian traditional dishes, like different sweets, few communities of Assamese people even prepared an uncommon dish made up of red and eggs. This is how you collect these red ants from their trees. I have been visiting many indigenous communities in different parts of India by my bicycle. But this will be my first time that I am going to taste and experience collecting some unusual food items. They hunt as a group and collect their food. Ultimately, the villager took me inside the forest. Searching for the red ants in the jungle, arranging long stick to bring them down, removing the ants from their eggs is one of the uncertain and painful process. It is all the pursuit of experiencing and documenting the process of preserving this traditional way of preparing this unique dish red ant for the next generation to come. This is going to be one of the most difficult tasks that's going to be happen in this village to collect the red ant eggs. I started my journey in search of such a village to see those red ants and to experience the process of egg collection. This village is stunning with natural surrounding. They have tea gardens everywhere. The region is quite nearer to the hills of Nagaland in the south and few hundred kilometers from the easternmost Himalayan range. Living and if the nature, this majority of the village lifestyle depends on agriculture and related farming. While few of the farmers, while few of the families went to town for job, many are still living in the village, celebrate and enjoy their traditional way of living their life. Being Bihu is their main festival of the year, they prepare different sweets, dishes, and also perform traditional dance. They also prepare special dish of red and eggs during the first day of Bihu. They believe this dish is like a medicine for many of the diseases like chicken pox. Whenever you hear for the first time that these people eat these insects also, won't you be curious to experience the same? Yes, you are going to see this experience documented never before. Take your own challenge to find those gnats in the jungle. First, try at your surrounding areas, especially the tall trees. Bringing the long bamboo is not less than a stability workout for you. The core and the shoulder will be activated. Shaking this long bamboo while you are standing is not an easy job. They are at so high, you can't take them down. Neither I can climb up. The worker ants travel long, long way for their food. You can see them in their surrounding Very Finding easily. them is not easy. You have to search for many trees around you to find a nasty one. These red ants are quite active in their behavior and aggressive. They go long, long way to collect food. Their bites can be equally painful and it spray directly at the bite wound, which is very itching and painful. 
they have millions in numbers in their nest and after a couple of trees I fail to get a which to pick which not to pick as many nests are vacant. Ultimately, I had to take help of need to lasers. collect some tools to bring the nest down to collect the eggs. The nests are at too high. Climbing is also not feasible. You have to get a long stick, preferably a bamboo would be long enough to get them down. Oh shit, we got them! The process is as challenging as it looks. Many nests doesn't even have eggs. You have to be experienced to identify those. The ants are aggressive. The worker ants protect their nets. Bringing them down may lead to a painful task for you. They spread very quickly and escaping from them and their painful bites won't be an option for you. You have to bear enough the pain before daring to collect them. The hardest part and a time consuming process is to separate the ants safely from the eggs. Separating them, you can involve many process. Many people used to spread smoke or the, they put the ants into the water. but my villagers suggested me not to do that. He has taken quite a long time and put much effort to remove those ants from their eggs without hurting 